All right, so I think we have to. I'm approaching through the wrong passage. I think. I think we need to go through the left side because it has a platform. Um, does anyone remember guidebooks? Because like, no one makes guidebooks anymore, and it makes me sad because I used to really like reading guidebooks. For some games, my mom would do a thing where we'd get the guidebook first, and the game later, uh, which I thought was... So I just kind of obsessed with the guidebook for like a month before actually getting the game. It's so like Mario and Luigi Partners in Time is one, where it's like, I basically had the guidebook memorized by the time I even played the game, so I kind of had a good idea what I was doing. I, I find Partners in Time a lot easier than um, Superstar Saga, and th then a lot of people do, because a lot of people cite uh, Partners in Time for being too hard. Uh, I don't find Partners in Time that bad, because I literally studied the guidebook. I did not mean it as a diagonal throw. Uh, I had a weird Prima guide for Sonic Heroes. It was like a mini guide. It was like a fourth of the size of like the full-sized guides, but it had all the same content, so like... It's like reading for ants. Um, I mean, I don't like jellyfish because of this level, I'll be honest, but that won't become appear apparent until like the final two screens. Um, there's a lot of really nasty jellyfish segments. Oh, come on. This isn't hard. <laughs> like, I, pr I promise this isn't that hard. I'm just really rusty because when I did my last run, it was like a month ago, because like, I got sick. And then I started coughing for a month, so I've been basically sick for two months. Um, and that's why I haven't been streaming. Oh, shoot. And then when it lands in the electricity, you're extra screwed, so um... Again, this isn't like the easy part of the level, by the way. So... Hope you're ready for that. Um... I almost want to be like, hey, if anyone has like wants to do like a Q and A, like ask me like video game stuff. Uh, now would actually be a good time, but uh, that also requires um, me to actually think about video game trivia. <laughs> I've actually thought about doing one of those Twitter things where it's like, oh, for every like, uh, I'll answer one question, but. I never get that many likes on Twitter, <laughs> to be blunt. Okay, that was the right idea, I just timed it badly. But yeah, that's what you're supposed to do, use the double dash to, to fly up, basically. Honestly... You've never made a post on Twitter? <laughs> yeah, that's that's fair. I mean, I'd follow you if your account wasn't, like, privated, which I think you said it's privated or something. Or just lo on lockdown because it's old or something. Um... Hmm, I think I need to throw it earlier. Yeah, I definitely think I have to throw it earlier. <laughs> you just never told anyone? Yeah, that's fair too. Yeah, that, that's perfect. Uh, I just need to time it a little bit better. I need to do a diagonal left and then a diagonal up, and then we're good. Cool. Um, figured it out. It only took five minutes. I swear I'm good at this game. Okay, I, I shouldn't hold down CR then. I need to hold down CR during the second dash. See, like, I don't get frustrated very often with this game. It's weird. Uh, a lot of people get, like, really mad at Celeste, uh, but I, I really don't. <laughs> I just kind of roll with it, mainly because you, if you do fail, you don't... Come on. You don't really have to go back too far. Um, there's very rarely long stretches uh, with no checkpoints, and those irk me. There we go. But other than that, uh, I really don't mind too much. Also, by the way, uh, I completely overhauled, like, all of my, like, bit alerts, just in case anyone is wondering. Um, 
I don't usually plug this at all. Um, but yeah, I actually completely overhauled my alerts. Okay, I remember this room. You have to bank it off of the wall and then do that. There we go. And when you grab the key, it teleports you. Thank goodness. Um, I've been watching a streamer who frequently says, can we get some pogs in the chat? So I'm instinctively trying to not say that and steal someone else's gimmick. Okay, I almost got that right. Um, first try, but uh, botched the last part. Yeah, I didn't have enough momentum. I needed to go more right. I thought about making a, a, a pog emote, but I also don't know what I do for a pog. Like, would it just be like a Vulpix pog? There we go. That's what I'm doing wrong. Okay, shoot. We have to bank, bank it off of both. Got it. Cool. Um, see, this is... Like, I'm not frustrated. Like, this is hard, but I'm not frustrated. There we go. I've also thought about making emotes based on characters I like. Um, instead of just, you know, brand... Have my brand be entirely Vulpix. Um, I've been sitting on an emote that I've been working on of Lysithia from Fire Emblem for like... Three months now. <laughs> And I still haven't finished it, to be honest. Oh, okay, so here's a new mechanic. Um, the bramble, you can throw the jellyfish through. Like that. See, like, it's so technical that I don't exactly mind dying a bunch, because every time you die, you at least get better. Um, at least in theory. <laughs> Uh, a lot of times I just hit my head against the wall until I figure out, wait, I'm doing this completely wrong. I have done- I have done one Fire Emblem. I did a Let's Play of Sacred Stones back in like 2016. <laughs> it was a disaster because I kept having audio issues. Um, but because of the two playthrough nature and I had an Ephraim file on standby, it actually worked out really well because I, I could replay the map but with the Ephraim file uh, for the later ones. Um, but that playthrough is bad, so I actually want to do a stream playthrough uh, where I go through Sacred Stones again. Because that is like my favorite Fire Emblem. So uh, I do not remind- do not- I must say remind because I have Kingdom Hearts on the mind. I do not mind replaying that periodically. Iron Man Effie, as in like... Okay, now where the heck do I go? I legitimately do not remember where the last key is. I'm pretty sure you can soft lock this if you're not careful. Uh, so I'm trying not to soft lock it. Thank you very much. When you unit dies to- yeah, I, I never do that, I'll be honest. I always save scum. I play in classic mode and, and then reload anyway, because... I don't know. I just do. <laughs> it's like... I, I want to have everyone alive, but I also don't want to play on casual for some reason. Even though I'm effectively just playing on casual. Um, to be fair, I also thought maybe it was just... Uh, an, an, an MCU-themed uh, Fire Emblem ROM hack. Which I'm sure probably someone's done a sprite edit of Iron Man as... Uh, a Fire Emblem character by now, based on internet culture. Okay, what key am I missing? I did this one. I am really weird about pop culture. Like, I know about Marvel. I don't really experience anything Marvel except, like, Spider-Man periodically. Like, Spider-Man 2018. Uh, the, the game, by the way, I should specify, is really good. Um, like, it's actually a super good game. Um, also, can I ask you a personal question? I'm not sure 
how many people are gonna get that. <laughs> that I'm not actually asking a personal question, <laughs> for the record. Did I get this for second try for real? This took me so long originally. <laughs> it's like, uh, this took me an unbelievably long time. I guess I made it up for it, made up for it though, by just spending like five minutes trying to find this key. So it'll work out. Um, so this whole section you can skip. Uh, you can basically, in this room, you can go around all this bramble. I'm not even gonna dare attempt this, but it's a speedrun strat. This is the pretty part of the level. And the good music part of the level. Also, I think I have the music really cranked. Uh, but it matches my settings on the other Celeste parts, so I'm just gonna kinda leave it and try to talk loudly enough to be heard. Um, but if you need me to turn it down, I... Yeah, just let me know. Yeah, it's, just, it's pretty easy to guess. Um, to be fair. Shoot. Uh, I think I need to toss it over? Uh, oh yeah, I heard Frank or Facey did that, and I hear it's terrible. <laughs> oh, it's actually good. I, I was hearing really bad things about it. Oh shoot, I didn't have a second dash. <laughs> That's my, my bad. I also have sub goals, but I actually am not really enforcing them since we're just stuck in this room for a little while. I do not want to talk about the the, the hero's pass. I'm gonna be honest. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's super cursed. Uh, my very short take is when I like to put things in perspective. When I first heard about it, I thought it was ten dollars a year. No, it's ten dollars a month. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I'm super not into this. To be fair, it's also like just mobile game culture in general. Like, mobile games in general are toxic as heck. So, um... So like... You know, like, I refuse to touch a lot of... What am I supposed to do here? Oh, I know. I think I see it. It's gonna be awkward, but I think I see what I have to do here. Yeah, I think that's right. Yeah, it's a gotcha. Uh, basically, you get like certain bonus features, like being able to uh, replay levels until all of your like daily stamina is out, which is really good for grinding. Um, you get... Sp there's literally pay to win. Um, because if you buy the FE pass, all your unit stats go up by plus two. So yeah, it's literally pay to win. So that's fun. Um, and you get special units. Which with really stupid, terrible terribly good stats, like a special version of Lin. Um, and I, yeah, I think the new costume for Lin has better stats too. So yeah, it's super cursed. I am not a fan of this at all. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm going to be playing free to play still. Again, I only spent $5 one time because I wanted Easter Lucina, do not judge. <laughs> um, and that's the only time I ever paid money. And by the way, I did get Easter Lucina. So it, it actually did work out. Yeah, do not judge <laughs> my life choices. That room took me so long my first attempt, so I'm glad I got through it like four times. Um, I forgot Alphonse had a dad, to be honest. Um, but yeah, that's all I'm gonna say on the Fate Pass. I'm basically it's toxic pay to win mobile gamer schlock. Um, and you can buy, like, TMS for a fraction of the cost of the Fade Pass a year. <laughs> hey, go play Tokyo Mirage Sessions. I can't forget Alphonse for a reason I can't talk about on stream. Um, 
Maybe I'll I'll try to remind me now. I might tell you later if I if I remember <laughs> if I remember to talk about it. But yeah, I have a specific reason why I can't ever forget Alphonse exists, uh, and it's kind of cursed. So um. Yeah, go play TMS. I wish I could be playing TMS. <laughs> uh, no, it's fine. It's just one of those things. TLDR, um, the same reason I can never forget Takumi exists in Fate. Um, so if you know that reason, you can put two, two, two and two together, but I'm not going to say anything more. Okay, I need to go diagonal, I think. I discovered you can stream kind words, so whenever that goes on a Steam sale, I actually want to do like a chill, like kind words stream. Just as a random thing. Um, I don't know how many people would be interested in just watching me play that, but I want to do different things. Um, I want to really diversify my content. I hate using the word content, I'll be honest, because it makes me think of like you know, yo, like, comment, subscribe, sub to me on Patreon, stuff like that. That's just like, I don't, mm, I don't like the content creator stigma. Um, so I don't know a better word, though. But yeah, I really want to stream kind words, but I also don't own it. Also, no one gifted to me. <laughs> just as a general blanket warning. <laughs> okay, that's not the right move. Hmm. Oh shoot, I have an idea. It's dumb, but it might work. It's not how you're supposed to do it, but it might work. Well, it would help if I didn't botch that. Yeah, I know. I'm just saying, it's like, because you literally just subbed at the beginning of the stream. I'm like, yeah, no one can be money. Um... Yeah, sub goals, I for five subs. Again, no pressure, by the way, if you can't. But, um, Mario and Luigi, because I like Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. Um, and basically we'll take any excuse to play it. Um, and it's also an easy game. It's like eight hours for an RPG. So, um, it's kind of low-key. I think the one sub goal I put up was like Breath of the Wild 100%, which is like... I guess that shows how little, I think, how not likely getting to 15 subscribers is. I really need to stream more regularly, um, build up an audience. Yeah, bit alerts have been completely overhauled. Um, also, if you're watching the post upload, hi. This is originally streamed on twitch.tv. There we go. Now it just needs to live. Cool. We lived successfully. 